everybody's healthy. Uh, you know, everybody made it through. Hopefully, uh, Patrick doesn't have to use his mask anymore, so he's off that restriction. So his looks will improve. Uh, but uh, other than that, we're okay. You think it was impacting him at all? I mean, he started to slip a little to, bit. It has to a little bit with the shooting. I mean, you know, it, I mean, I haven't had had a broken nose before, but. I, over the years, I've seen players that's really bothered them. Uh, even the special made mask, which I think his was, uh, it has to impact you. Your depth perception, trying to see your peripheral vision, uh, just your feel of having something uh, strapped on all the time. So uh, <clears throat> hopefully that'll help him. I thought he and Amir did a heck of a job last night in their rotations, defensively, the traps. I thought that was a game changer for us last night. Their energy, speed, and quickness helped us a lot uh, in, in getting, trying to get uh, Logan totally under control last night. You said a few weeks ago or a month ago that as a coach you never trust success. Are you anywhere close to that? I still don't trust it because you saw last night. I mean, I, 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 and I made it, made it point last night. <clears throat> No, we're in a situation where we're still, a, I've been singing this song, and people don't want to listen, we're a growing team. I mean, we're still developing, still guys still getting better, starting two second year guys. And if we don't play the game the right way, defensively and offensively, you know, we can go in, you know, the wrong way each night. So we got to have that approach, the hard playing approach, 50-50 balls. Because uh, we can't come out and just say, okay, we're the Toronto Raptors, we're here, and expect to win. Uh, so that's the challenge I hit our players with. Uh, and for the most part, we've won games through hard work. And maybe 